fun idea, fun weekend. We get some sunshine that's going to be sticking with us both days, so a great looking weekend shaping up. But we have the clear skies in play already, and that's going to help us cool off. We were chilly today with temperatures only in the low to mid 30s, and right now we're at 27 degrees with those clear skies. And our temperatures are going to be allowed to fall off rather quickly as uh, we go into the overnight hours, especially with those winds starting to back up just a little bit. The clear skies and just it's February, late February, you get those clear skies. Oftentimes you get the cold temperatures. 18 is what it feels like in town. 16 for Latrobe and Connellsville. 18 Washington and Waynesburg up to the north. You can see uh, 12 to 14 degrees between Dubois and Franklin. Actual temperatures in the mid to upper 20s for most everyone. So we have these uh, temps that are, are chilly. But we have a few more degrees to go before we bottom out. And early tomorrow morning, we're going to dip down into the teens. By the time we get to 8 o'clock, we're already talking temps mid-20s. So uh, pretty much where we are now. And then into the afternoon, we're going to get those highs into the upper 40s. Getting into the evening plans, temperatures not nearly as cold. And then early on Sunday, we'll be in the 20s again. So not as cold as it will be tomorrow morning. And then we're looking at highs near 50 degrees before all is said and done. So the next two days come with mild temperatures and sunshine together. And it's going to be a weekend, so a wonderful weekend is shaping up. 49 Saturday, 50 degrees on Sunday, no issues either day. Now, we don't have anything happening nearby. We're clear, and we're clear until you get to Chicago, and there's just a couple clouds out that way. So the whole region is very quiet, and we'll stay that way thanks to this high pressure that's slowly drifting through the area. This will keep us quiet. It'll eventually turn on those winds from the south a little more and draw in some of that warmer air still into Sunday, but it's also going to draw in some moisture. Typically warmer air has a moisture element with it. And you can see on the bottom left hand side of your screen, the clouds are going to start to build in here. This is out ahead of some showers that won't arrive until later on Monday. So we get most of Monday dry too. And then we start seeing shower chances Tuesday. Those showers sticking around, they'll dry up Tuesday evening. Wednesday, the next system lifts in, especially in the afternoon. That starts off as rain, ends as snow, and we can pick up some accumulations from this one rolling through. It will also drop our temperatures big time and kick up the winds later in the week. So we're not done with winter just yet. We just get to hit a little pause button as we go through the weekend again. 18 degrees, clear skies tonight. Tomorrow, you're looking at that sunshine. Highs in the upper 40s, close to 50 degrees before the day is through and pretty much through the day. Clear skies, 8 a.m. 23. You're talking mid 40s for uh, 2 to 5 o'clock. And then as we get into the evening hours, not nearly as cold as what we had tonight. Clear skies throughout and those clear skies continue into Sunday. Maybe a couple clouds mixing in later in the day, but mostly sunny skies. Beautiful looking weekend. 50 degrees on Monday with those showers. Those showers change the snow on Thursday and highs come Friday. Only look to make it into the mid 20s. Very cold there. And with all this going on, remember the KDK weather app can help sort it out, whether it's the cold temperatures in the morning or the showers coming into play next week. It has it all covered and it's free. Just search CBS Pittsburgh in the App Store and Google Play.